Hello, Taurians. Welcome to your uh, bonus read. You guys were the highest viewed sign of the week. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I love you guys. I truly, truly do. And I appreciate each and every one of you. So thank you for being a bonus read. Thank you for the likes and the, uh, the, the eyeballs watching and the clicks. It really adds up getting the messages out there to those who need to uh, hear them. So, but so Taurus, I do appreciate each and every one of you. It's October 1st. Isn't that wild? Isn't that, a, that was a weird segue. I apologize, but it's October 1st. I cannot believe it. All right, Taurus. Um, I have Wheel of Fortune Tarot for the main deck. I have Golden Art Nouveau Tarot for the clarifying deck. And the links to these decks can be found down below in the description box. Five of Pentacles reverse in a judgment. Some of you might be getting some really good news around your money, settlements, things like that. Um, it's life changing. It, it, Five of Pentacles reverse is getting out of a slump. It's, it's getting your groove back. It's feeling alive and I want to say electrified, you know, just feeling a part of it all. And a judgment is a fundamental change. So what I'm, I feel that the link between these two is a tower. Something's going to probably drop into your world. That's going to change, change it all. Especially if you have applied for a new job or anything like that, you probably have really good news coming in because the five of pentacles reverse, look at that hangman reverse, three of swords reverse, ace of wands right there. Maybe you guys already have something new and it's just really going to start to pick up. Let's see what's going on here, Taurus. And this is a bonus read, so get comfy. Grab your favorite adult beverage. I have Kim Crawford. Cab, what is it? Sauvignon Blanc. I don't know. I, I had a hard time saying that for some reason. All right, Taurus. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Taurus. If you are a Taurus, know a Taurus. Feel like being a Taurus. Taurians, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Taurus and this resonates. Oops, I almost dropped them. You could be dealing with a Taurus. It could resonate as the main story and Taurus can be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Taurus or for a Taurus. Take it as it resonates. Collect the messages. Gosh, come on cards. What is going on? I'm like thinking, was this the right deck? It's like, come on, come on. All right, Taurus, general energy. What is the story that needs to come out today? What is the story that needs to come out today for Taurus? What is the storyline? Lovers, the love boat. You got the lovers, Taurus. Look at that, the bottom of the deck, what's coming in? You guys have some new love. I actually feel like if you've been talking to somebody, you've been kind of connected. I feel like a real relationship is really blossoming here. What's influencing the lovers? Gemini energy. What's influencing the lovers? The devil. Holy moly. When I see the devil and the lovers, it feels like two people who can't get enough of one another. What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? This is a good connection. What's the reason for the reading? You got the page of cups reverse. What's in the past? What's in the past for Taurus? The fool taking a chance. Okay, I'm sorry, I just wanna. All right, what's on Torian's mind? What's on the Torian's mind? What is it? The Empress reverse. Yeah, I mean, so this whole line, the lovers, Empress reverse, and the Page of Cups reverse, and these two cards even kind of look alike. Maybe you connected strongly with somebody and somebody could have pulled back. Let's see why. What's in the near future? What's in the near future for Taurus? Ooh, Virgo, Gemini energy, the magician. You got one, two, three, four, five out of six majors, Taurus. If you want to include that, you got judgment there. How do you see yourself right now? How do the Taurians see themselves? How do the Taurians see themselves? Ten of Swords reverse. I feel like you're really in your head because somebody pulled themselves back. You might not be hearing from someone, but the connection is so strong. It's it's both sides. What what's coming in you don't see coming? The moon reverse information i feel something to be revealed something to, that will enlighten you How, what what are currently in your emotions thank you 
the Knight of Cups. I feel like a Taurus is really connected with somebody. But they're not telling you what I see in these cards that they're equally connected to you. But I, why did they pull back? What's the outcome here? What's the outcome here for Taurus? What's the outcome here for Taurus? I mean, the cards have been helping themselves thus far. Come on, cards. What's the outcome here for Taurus? Am I going to have to pull? Okay, there it is. The Knight of Pentacles reverse. The what if game. Knight of Pentacles reverse Virgo energy. Maybe somebody in Virgo season, you met somebody and something started to what you deemed as cool, like the energy of it cooled, but it didn't. You got the strength and the Queen of Cups reverse. Give me one more card, the outcome. So the Knight of Pentacles reverse can be the what if game. What if they played me? What if they're not interested? What if I got my hopes up? It's a card of managing negative expectations. What's the outcome here? for Taurus. I, I, something tells me to get two cards. I feel like this person is equally connected and interested and more than interested. You got the devil here and devil is chaining two people there. It feels like a twin flame type of relationship. What's the outcome here for Taurus? Yeah, page of swords. Good news coming in. I feel like somebody, well, four cups reverse, and the Ace of Swords. Yeah, you're getting the truth here. And communication. This person's all in. But they're just... I almost feel like somebody got bad advice from somebody. Or it scared them. This connection scares this person. But I feel like they're going to tell you that. What's the lovers? Center of the reading for Taurus. What are What's the lovers about? Gemini. Okay, thank you. Yeah, full reverse in the Five of Wands. Holy cow. The lovers clarifying the lovers. Who am I? David Copperfield. How did that happen? 78 cards. And it didn't come out reverse. It came out upright. Lovers is clarifying the lovers. But that card fell out of a fear, full reverse, and a five of wands. And a two of swords and the ace of cups. This person has a lot of love for you. Don't let them fool you. They do. In fact, with the devil here, I don't think they can get you out of their system. What is the devil here? Capricorn energy. What is the devil here? Yeah, five of cups. But they're afraid that you're going to break their heart. That's what I'm getting. Scorpio energy. Five of cups and the devil. Nine of cups reverse. I feel like somebody is a glass half empty kind of personality here and you're dealing with them and on your mind is an empress reverse and that is a card that's one of your majors with libra empress reverse can feel sad um disjointed feel like like i i just want to know one way or another i want to know you got somebody who is a glass half empty i feel like they started to really feel something and it scared the shit out of them they pulled themselves back because they don't want to get hurt but they're hurting you by doing that and I don't think they realize it. Page of Cups reverse, reason for the reading. Page of Cups reverse, reason for the reading for Taurus. Ten of Cups. Yeah, I mean, look at this. So positive. But somebody, I think it, it got away with away from somebody here. Ten of Cups, Page of Cups reverse. Why the Ten of Cups? Hangman. Yeah, I think somebody is afraid of losing you. It, it doesn't make sense, does it? They're afraid of losing you, so they're going to pull back and not speak to you, which may cause you to stop giving to this. I honestly feel in the nick of time, you're going to get the information you need with that page of swords. All right, what is the fool in the past? Aquarius energy, page of pentacles wants to come out and it won't go back in my deck. What is the Empress reverse on your mind? By the way, the Page of Pentacles fool. I just feel like two people really connected in it. I mean, it, this was a connection. This was like, this was a really strong connection. I think it took both by storm. It just really, I don't think two people were prepared for this. Empress reverse on your mind. Why the Empress reverse? I mean, it's kind of obvious based on, yeah, Devil and the Nine of Wands. Somebody's holding on. They're like, no, this connection has to mean something. Two of Pentacles. 
trying to still go with the flow, trying to be open to something, not wanting to make any hasty decisions. I feel like you're trying to be the understanding one, trying to be positive about this. I feel honestly, Taurus, you're probably the positive one and this person's a bit of a pessimist. I think, I, I dare I say they're already falling in love, but they're a pessimist about love. They, to them, maybe love hurts. What is the magician in the near future? King of Cups reverse. Ooh, that is so telling. Right there. King of Cups reverse and the magician. Especially if you're a Taurus that has done okay in life. More than okay. If you appear to have your shit together, if you feel appear to be a whole kind of human, you have a J-O-B. I don't know, all of, something about whatever you do, it appears effortless. It appears like you, like it's, I honestly feel an insecurity with this King of Cups reverse. I feel like somebody looks at you and they realize, what if I don't live up to Taurus's expectations? And Taurus realizes it one day and they walk out on me. Near future, King of Cups reverse and the magician. I mean, that is drastic energy difference. What is the King of Cups reverse here? Yep, Six of Swords. But this person needs to learn. I I honestly I, I really feel like it's it's an insecurity. Six of Swords is Aquarius, and the same energy they brought to you, they need to try to maintain that. Six of Swords is moving on. Somebody wants to move on from hurt. I feel like this person is is just as unhappy as a Taurus, not communicating. Page of Cups reverse is a lack of communication. Near future, King of Cups reverse, this person's like, what am I doing? I'm going to lose the best thing I've ever found. And I don't want to do that. Six of Swords is maybe they're trying to heal it. That's why there's a moon reverse next to it. But we'll get there. Let's first do the Ten of Swords reverse, how you see yourself. I feel like you're in your head because you're thinking, did I do something? Did I talk to the, did I try too much? And what am I missing here? Ten of Swords reverse, how you see yourself. A lot of Gemini. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, that's the issue right here. Queen of Pentacles is you appear to have your shit going on. Nobody has their shit going on 100% of the time or even 80% of the time. But something about you, Taurus, appears that you really have it 100% of the time. And this person's like, feels like they're inferior to your energy. That's what I really feel is going on. But I do feel like you're trying to be very understanding. And how you see yourself with the Queen of Pentacles and the Ten of Swords reverse is, I, I mean, just, just tell me what's the problem. Queen of Pentacles wants to help. She wants to nurture. She want, If you need something, she is there. And I just feel like you just need that communication. But you, and you will get it with the chariot and temperance reverse, king of swords reverse. You're dealing with somebody who doesn't let people in very easily. You got to this person where nobody or very few have, and it scared them. And I feel like what really scares them is losing you. All right, moon reverse, energy coming in you don't see coming. And remember, we just had that full moon last night or was it two days no two nights ago as i do this reading it was september 29th so the moon reverse here after the full moon i feel four swords reverse this person is very anxious i feel like this connection made them nervous and not talking to you makes them nervous and every day you guys aren't talking it makes them nervous so i feel like they are going to bring their knight of cups death reverse death reverse is that scorpio's king of cups reverse and I feel like I, I bet you how this conversation is going to go is I'm sorry. I just, I needed time to think, can we do this? Can we try again? Can we start over? That's, I feel like a lot of starting over in your emotions, nine of cups. And I feel like a Taurus is very understanding about this. What's the nine of cups in your emotions, my loves? What's the nine of cups in your emotions? Ace of cups to reverse. And if you look at this energy, I was when I clarify the Knight of Cups and Ace of Cups reverse, and what I feel with that is a look at her taking that cup to somebody who's in need of help. I really feel if this person would just be honest with you, you'd be right there. Like, what can I do to help you? Queen of Cups reverse, Magician reverse, and the Three of Cups. I feel on the surface, this person is really good. Um, the Three of Cups is uh, going out, having fun. But when you get deeper, 
Queen of Cups reverse, Magician reverse. You got some deep, deep insecurity issues going on. Next to a King of Wands. Yeah, I'm sorry. I saw Eight of Wands reverse and the Knight of Swords. I almost feel like somebody is surface level. I take this as it resonates, Taurus, but I feel like they told you something that's not true. As my head is really itching as I say that, I feel like I'm onto something. I feel like they told you something that is not true. When I see that King of Wands, Eight of Wands reverse, Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords is like, I feel like somebody kept you looking this way, looking that way, looking that way. So you don't see the biggest picture here. Eight of Wands reverse. I feel like this King, it's almost like they talk about themselves now, but it was past tense. What I mean by that is, if this person said what they do for a living, maybe they lost that job. This is, this is, this is not going to, this is just, uh, I don't feel like it has to resonate for everybody for all of these messages to take place. But for somebody out there, if you're really, really confused, I feel like the story they told you was past tense. And I, I it doesn't, I just feel like they kind of fell off their horse here. And it, it makes sense in your emotions, nine of cups, you're on that horse bringing a cup to somebody who's in need to heal. And I just feel like they're embarrassed of telling you the truth. What is this Knight of Pentacles reverse in the Page of Swords in the outcome? Knight of Pentacles reverse. Why the Knight of Pentacles reverse in the outcome here? Knight of Pentacles. Ooh, Three of Swords. And some of you are like, should I give this up? Stop investing, pull myself back. But you're feeling it. The Three of Swords is a pain. It's saying, I feel connected to this person. I feel connected to this situation. I don't know if I'm ready to give it up. And then I feel in the 11th hour, you get the message in that Page of Swords. You do have news coming. I feel like they're clarifying. Their, this person is a basket of insecurities going on. What's the Page of Swords? Okay. Hierophant reverse. There you are. And that just feels like they're a, I mean, look at a page to a hierophant reverse, a page to a king. Like they're not good enough. High priestess and the star. Look at that fell out of this. High priestess, star, two majors. I feel like they are so lucky to find someone like you, but they're afraid they can't hold on to someone like you. I said the difference between the past and the present is a tower. There it is. Tower and the six of cups. This connection surprised two people but I feel like one of the one of the duos were ready for this the other one was like they were just trying to get themselves back and this comes in if they would just communicate I feel like you have the patience for them for to or even to help them go through something like this but it just yeah it really feels like they're afraid they can't hold on to you but what I'm seeing in the cards, when I see an Empress reverse and a Two of Pentacles, Empress reverse can feel very, I mean, that's your major in reverse that's saying, I feel rejected, which means that you must have had hope uh, in this connection. Something about this person gave you hope. I mean, you got the Fool in the Page of Pentacles. And I feel like this different level of energy and all throughout, I mean, you got the full in the, uh, the page of pentacles, the empress and the two of pentacles, a major and a minor, a major and a minor. So that right there tells me somebody's doing better in life than the other person, but it doesn't matter in the, in, in the gears of heart and the energy of the heart space. I feel like it's very equal. I think you guys are very good for one another, but this person can't stop thinking. I think I need to have more in life. So Taurus can think I'm as good of a catch as I see them. I think they pull back because they just felt like they were unbelievably lucky to find you, but they're afraid they can't keep you. So they pull themselves back. It doesn't make sense. I know it doesn't make sense, but I got to tell you what I'm feeling here. And did you guys just see that? You probably didn't see that, but the lights just kind of blinked off and on. I'll take that. I'll take that as a confirmation spirit. All right, Taurus, I love you guys. Have a great rest of your Sunday evening, and I will see you guys Tuesday on Earth Sign Day. All right, Taurus, take care.